The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Weighing in at 215 pounds, Gregory. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. A competitor with his share of detractors, but he wants to prove them all wrong here tonight. Johnny Wrestling! And his opponent from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano! Gargano is no stranger to success. He's main event at some of the biggest events in NXT history. And Johnny's well equipped to continue that upward trajectory on the main roster. Scratch and claw through the independence through NXT. Now the spotlight is on Johnny Wrestling. And he will not give up that spotlight to anyone. Guys, we have a superstar that is molded to be the next big thing. While he might be molded, he can still use a little refining. If he can harness that potential, we're looking at the next big thing. Sure, a little rough around the edges, Corey, but there's something that comes with time and experience. But let's talk about Johnny Gargano, one of the most loyal men we've ever seen in WWE. Whether you're talking about his family, friends, or most importantly here, the fans, Johnny always gives his all for those who support him. And in some ways, Johnny's loyal to a fault setting himself up for unexpected betrayal when his friends or said fans turn their back. Here's the cover for the win. Kicks out before the two count. Somehow still has the energy for a quick kick out. Oh. Samoan driver. That has got to be it. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Despite giving his all, Gargano wasn't able to spare himself from harm there. Top rope, putting it all on the line. Take off. Splash! Gargano keeps him at bay. Tornado oh. DDT! Talk about devastation. Picked up and around. Oh, that hurt. He skirts around it. Great job refocusing to reverse that. What a counter by Gargano. Now, there may be no escape. Gargano escape. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap out. This is about career longevity. He is in serious trouble here and finds his way out. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. That's a forearm that'll floor you.
Uh-oh. What an elbow drop. He thinks he has it. Digging deep for a kick out. How in the world did he kick out? Johnny's reeling. He's in serious danger. Uh-oh. Go for the run. Top slam. That could ground Gargano for good. And that'll be a rope break right there. Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. He deflects it right back. Oh, and a discus clothesline. Took their head off. Uh-oh. I think I know what's about to come on. Super kick by Gargano. Fearless offense from Gargano. Giving his all for the fans who have rallied behind. Johnny Gargano gets a huge win. Here is your winner, Johnny Gargano. He really got the better of the opposition here. I agree, it was quite the display tonight. What we just saw is another example of why Gargano is known around the world as Johnny Wrestling. The son of a dream, the American nightmare. Michael, a man who redefined himself away from WWE and is now a main event star. is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! Corey, I will never forget the night that you and I had the opportunity to call this man's amazing return to WWE. You're right about that, Saxton. A true WrestleMania moment, if there ever was one. Certainly an accomplished career his first time around. Well, many would say this version of Cody Rhodes is completely transformed and set to take over the main event picture of WWE. his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds. This is a match that folks have been clamoring for, and they are excited to finally get it.
Is he prepared for an opponent with the family pedigree and natural talent of Cody Rhodes? That's a great question, and luckily for us, we won't have to wait long to get the answer. And here we have a superstar who's been grinding his teeth at the Performance Center as of late. Yeah, the Cravat Sleeper is in. Sleeper hold. Give up now. Swallow your pro He needs to find an escape route. Nice. Back suplex. Ooh. Very nice. Missed timing with that springboard. Set him up for the Russian oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. He steers clear of contact. <laughs> Boom! What a forearm. Ow, oh, what a shot. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Look out! Whoa! What a landing! Big time risk pays off! The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Corey, what do you think Cody needs to do here to assure victory? Not much more than he's been doing in general. Stay the course. Keep focused. Don't try anything too flashy. That last one might be a little hard for Cody to resist, though. Uh-oh. We're gonna see it. What power. Sit out, power bomb. Two. Stopping the refs count at two. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Standing me. Uh-oh. Broken up with a fist to the face. Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Bam! Spring, does he have him here? Kicks out. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Oh, look at this. Is it enough, guys? Is Shot it enough to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. Landing. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh, enough already. Fighting back with a counter. Cody Rhodes. Throw the breaker. Kick out just in time. That's really as close as it gets. Cody Rhodes has his opponent right where he wants it. There's Crossroads. Cody Rhodes nailed it. Cover. Two count. Hard earned victory for this superstar in what was an incredible matchup. And are we going to get... There we go. Some good sportsmanship in the end. Bound awesome. by mutual respect. Well, that scene just warms my heart. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Greenwich, Connecticut. Weighing in at 248 pounds, Mr. McMahon. You know, Corey, when sometimes we show up at hotels in different towns at 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, 
Mr. McMahon's there with his trainer heading to the gym. The physical embodiment of success. The man's got grapefruits the size of small planets and has to feel like a billion dollars stepping into the ring amidst his own creation. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 250 pounds, Joe Hogan. The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. Looking into the eyes of this competitor tonight, you know he understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make big headway on the roster. And then there's Mr. McMahon, the boss, the big cheese, the head honcho, the high muckamuck, the top dog, the man upstairs, the taskmaster, the ringleader, and the kingpin all rolled into one. And that's just outside the ring. Imagine the type of force he is inside the ring. He knows how to avoid. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fade it. And breaks out of the sleeper. Ooh. Ooh. Uh-oh. Hazardous part of town here on the apron. A back suplex right onto the apron. Oh, working on the arm. Arm ringer. Oh, and a kick. That was nasty. Measured knee drop. Hook in the arm for a Fujiwara arm bar. Ah, oh, Fujiwara arm bar applied. Corey, I'd ask what you think Mr. McMahon's weaknesses are here, but I know you'd only talk in circles to avoid answering. So I'll just say that I think this match will come down to in-ring experience. Cole, you seemingly don't care about insulting who signs your checks, but I can't disagree with you there. While Mr. McMahon is certainly an impressive physical specimen who's had some epic matches, our boss hasn't put in the reps that most superstars have. He's lost some of his win now. Oh, man. Uh-oh. What a takedown. Fujiwara armbar. Ah, uh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Hoping to end it here. He's able to beat a two count. You expect these pins to last much longer at this stage in the match. Ah, uh, clubbing blow to the back. Shot after shot. Oof, ruthless striking. Setting foot in the ring now. Has the leg trap. Fisherman suplex. Oh my god. Oh, and a backbreaker. Right to the spine. And it's Mr. McMahon with the reversal. That'll light up your chest. Wow, stole one from his opponent's artillery. Good officiating there, referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. Leg drop. It's effective. 
He is just reeling from that offense. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be. Uh-oh. Stunner from Mr. McMahon. Mr. McMahon put a stamp on this one. Three, no, two count. I don't know how he just kicked out, and I'll tell you what, I don't really think he knows either. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Insulting. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Simple but effective leg drop. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Mr. McMahon on the receiving end. Bam! Oh, what a right hook. The end is looming now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. What a good Watch. measure. He'll head to the ring. I guess even Mr. McMahon likes a pop now and then. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Oh, and he's back in beating the count. Headlock, oh, a cheap shot right above the eye. Side headlock applied. Good, Good measure. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. No, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. Uh-oh. Stunner from Mr. McMahon. Mr. McMahon put a stamp on this one. Calls the pin off with a rope break. We're reaching a point where these superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's going to find a way to capital? Here he goes for the win! He did it! He did it! Here is your winner, Mr. McMahon! He really wanted this one bad. Yeah, what a major win for him here. I'm not too surprised at the outcome tonight. Mr. McMahon owns everything and everyone in this company. I'm still trying to get him to trade you. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, the Superstar. Some would say the Superstar thinks a little too much of themselves, but the tape doesn't lie. This is a serious contender for any title. They need to loosen up, have a little fun. Heck, maybe even lose a match once in a while. <laughs> what? That is horrible advice. I don't know about you guys, but I feel a sudden chill in the air. Well, Dexter Loomis has arrived. And his opponent from Recluse, Wyoming, weighing in at 230 pounds, Dexter Loomis. He's almost reptilian in his movements. You're right, Saxton. His walk, his crawl, his attacks in the ring, everything about Loomis. 
is nightmare fuel. The eyes of an artist who will paint a picture of his victims before their match. Competitors dread seeing their image painted by Loomis. I wasn't going to say anything, but Loomis painted Saxton earlier today. He did? Wait, can I at least keep the painting? Sure, if you survive. This superstar is quite the buzz behind him going into this match. And for good reason. He's proven to be one of the most fearless and determined superstars on the roster today. Certainly determined. We'll see if all that buzz around him is warranted tonight. And with Dexter Loomis, you never quite know what to expect. Other than the mind games and devastating offense and the intense creepiness. Yeah, Loomis is absolutely not the guy you want to stand across the ring from. To Saxton's point, that's both because of his fists and because of the van he keeps parked and running outside of the arena. Not necessarily in that order. Oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Neckbreaker. Oh, stomping away. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. What you doing here, Corey? The colossal clutch. Submission locked in tight, nowhere to go. Slipped right underneath, and just like that, he's out of the hold. Oh, strong impact. Dexter Loomis, of course, one of the most methodical, most cerebral superstars in all of WWE. No doubt he has a game plan for this matchup. Right, Corey? I think Saxton's more in line with Loomis's wavelength, but I'll try... Not allowing that to go on any longer. Loomis gets intercepted. Oh! With a th... You're a Nagy! Oh, the Anaconda Vice! He's got it locked in! It's locked in! Now would be a wise time to sub... A couple of knees there. That'll get him out of it. Super kick! And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Uh-oh. There. Gets inside the ring. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh. Oh, look at this. Dexter Loomis with the elevated arm triangle. This could do it. It's cinched in. I think we're just moments away from seeing a tap out. We're hearing a snap. The elevated triangle, but short shots to the ribs break the hold. Dexter Loomis locking up his opponent, rendering them tap out. What an incredible match and win for Dexter Loomis. Here is your winner, Dexter. Loomis. And that's a textbook win. A lot to be proud of there. No doubt about it. The better superstar definitely won tonight. A Samoan bulldozer is on the warpath.
The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from the Isle of Samoa. Weighing in at 350 pounds. The Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga! Umaga can be translated to mean either the beginning or end. Well, that's because when you face Umaga, it is the beginning of the end. The most dangerous Samoan competitor in the history of WWE. And that is saying a lot. His opponent from Yonkers, New York, weighing in at 265 pounds, Tommy. Looking out at the countless members of the WWE Universe in attendance, they are all here because of matches like this one. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. Here in WWE, Umaga has earned the nickname the Samoan Bulldozer, an apt title for someone who decimates his opponents with seemingly unstoppable force. I can't think of a better way to describe a competitor as powerful and ferocious as Umaga. When you see the Samoan Bulldozer rolling your way, you've got two options, run or be destroyed. With his incredible strength, Umaga has been able to obliterate obstacles and clear himself a road to big success. But he's tasked with quite the challenge in the form of his competitor across the ring. This guy has been tormenting the WWE roster for weeks now. Mistake by Umaga. Ooh. Continuing to work on their opponent's arm. Oh, man. An arm breaker takes him down. High cross body. And Umaga's brutal nature is very unique, but is there any way an opponent can turn that to their advantage? Yeah, Umaga's brutality makes him a formidable foe, but it also makes him vulnerable to more cerebral strategies. You need to fight smarter, not harder, when you're face-to-face -face with the Samoan Bulldozer. Okay, he is not going to let him make a mockery of things. He's got the answer for that one. Superstar setting up. Gun slinger and the cover for the win. Kick out just before two. These one counts are going to get harder and harder to kick out of. Just launched. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Now this is just a ruthless attack. Oh, such aggression. with that reversal. Getting him into the corner. Counter from Umaga. Executed that, it was good night. 
you have to wonder how much more can he take. And now the Samoan Bulldozer are going to have to dig a little deeper to close this one out. Ooh, saw it coming and hit him with a shot to the face. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Tossed around like a rag dog. Headbutt. The whole ring in between them. To the gut. That looked low to me. And an elbow. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Relentless. And this one might be headed ringside. Dodges. Ooh. Oh my gosh, with one hand. Oh, stiff headbutt. We can't take much more of this. I don't want to say he's done, but I can hear the fat lady warming up. Saw it coming and slowed it down with the back elbow. You can begin to see it in these superstars' faces. Exhaustion is beginning to set in. They're starting to breathe. This is it. Is it enough to put him away? No, somehow kicked out. Incredible, absolutely incredible. Umaga's lining up to finish this off. This will do it. Umaga, Samoa Spike. We've seen that win matches Cover. for Umaga. Here is your winner, the Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga! Impressive win for him here. He is definitely a superstar to watch in the weeks to come. That was a spectacular performance. The whole effing show. The following contest is an eight-man ladder match and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. A man who lives his life way up high.
67 pounds, the Superstar! Guys, we have incredibly high stakes here tonight in this ladder match. And it's because of those stakes that I suspect these superstars will do just about anything to be the first one to climb the ladder and grab the gold. This is a man who makes the most of every opportunity, and this is his biggest opportunity ever. Weighing in at 299 pounds. A potentially career-changing opportunity for these superstars here tonight in this Money in the Bank ladder match. That's right, Cole. Some competitors go their entire careers without being granted a championship opportunity. But tonight, one superstar won't have to worry about that as they'll have their title match banked and ready to be cashed in at the time of their choosing. This guy has had a great career already, but winning the title tonight takes his legacy to a whole new level. The Big Red Machine is here. And from the pits of hell, weighing in at 323 pounds, Kane! What a terrifying sight to behold. What a frightening presence. The evil inside this man. Matched by the frightening amount of destruction that Kane is capable of. A multi-time champion 
He's dominated WWE for many, many years. From Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 225 pounds, Scorpion! As the title gets into position here, let me remind everybody that the only way to win this match is to climb the ladder and grab the gold. That's right. No pinfalls, no submissions, no countouts, no disqualifications. The winner will be the first superstar who can successfully ascend the ladder and take possession of the title. But I assure you, it's not quite as easy as it sounds. He's got a good chance of becoming the new champion tonight, and the WWE Universe is buzzing about it. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 220 pounds, Ethan. The Money in the Bank contract is set, and we're ready to go here. You call it a contract, Cole. I call it a winning lottery ticket. It's not very often you actually get a chance to hold a winner in your hands. But tonight, one of these superstars will do just that. He is physically prepared. He is mentally prepared. This man is ready for this title opportunity. And from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 253 pounds, Chris 
pin. Who? Ladies and gentlemen, the title will be hanging high above the ring here tonight in what promises to be an incredible ladder match. And as we've seen in the past, the ladder will likely become more than just a set of steps used to reach the championship. There's a good chance we'll see it used as a weapon as well. He's been undergoing a lot of training for tonight, not taking this title opportunity lightly. Big guys, as the Money in the Bank contract is on the line here tonight. Which means that statistically, the winner of this match will likely go on to become champion. The champ certainly has his hands full here tonight, but he looks more than ready. The ring is almost overflowing with superstars in this eight-pack match. So many superstars, but only one will win. Long odds for all competitors involved, but each and every one will fight to the finish. I guarantee it. Able to elude it. Leg drop. Oh, clothesline. A oh, bad slam with some attitude. He fends off the attack. Stomp right to the arm. The champ taking their share of hits now. In a match that's so physical, Byron, how does a superstar block out the pain and climb the ladder? This matchup is a war of attrition. It often comes down to who's healthy enough, who has enough left in the tank to climb the ladder. The competitor must be able to fight through the agony suffered during the match to climb the ladder and take their shot at glory. You have to look at this as a do or die moment. And it's difficult to do that in a one-on-one -on -one ladder match, let alone when you're battling against multiple opponents. Shifts it back onto him. DDT! Ooh, sharp kick. DDT! Talk about devastation. Setting up. Oh, all the way out of the box. Blocked it. The knees up could provide a huge turnaround. Knee right to the gut. Chop block without warning. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Russian leg sweep. Holy meet the barricade. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Face first off the knee. He's ejected from the ring. Big forearm. Well scattered reversal there. All the way down. Sorry, you're a Ian uppercut. And he gets delivered back into the ring. And that holds RVD back. Oh, look at this. Arm wrench. Beautiful back kick. Close line. Tossed into the corner. Arms trapped. Thrown back in under the ropes. All the way crashing down. He is feeling it now. 
continuing to work on the arm with a, and that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Boom, nice. Hurled away. God. Right to the face. My God. Oh, oh what a drop kick. On the mark. Knee left. Nice takedown. And look at from a back suplex. Boom, back drop, suplex. On a high angle, right across the shoulders. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. The challenger is not in a great place. This has been an absolutely punishing Money in the Bank match. What now? What now? Off the barricade. Climb. Go for it. Climb. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Looking for the ripcord. A championship level move. Hey, he, he could win it here. Going for it all. Interesting timing to say the least. On to that unforgiving steel ladder. If this works, it could change the course of the match. Looking for more damage here. Oh, release back. Looking for the rip core. Uh oh, the arms are hung. Oh, what a close line. And there was some force on that move. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. This is right for him. And that was an effective attack, guys. He takes control. Fireman's carry. Nice takedown. and breaks careers, but right now we are looking at someone who was just made by that ladder match. Love them or hate them, you know they did everything they could to earn...